What's good, YouTube? It's Jay. We're back. Quick little sneaker review today on these LeBron 12 Corks. Recent pickup for me. Here's the black Nike Sportswear box. The tag right here, LeBron 12 EXT Cork. Retail, 250 I did not pay that. I got these for a crazy, crazy steal that I could not pass up. And if you're looking for these, um, you can probably find them under retail if you look hard enough because a lot of them are sitting on shelves. But let's go ahead and get into the review, guys. Here is the shoe. And what stands out most to me is this gold hit right here on the swoosh. It's like a reflective mirror gold swoosh, which looks really nice. You got black covering the positive material, and it's almost like a felt suede. Really smooth, nice um, added touch right there. And of course, you got the cork all over the upper and on the tongue. Really nice, just like the cork tens and other cork um, shoes that Nike has been releasing. Pretty much the same material. You got this gold, I don't know what this is called guys, so if you know, leave it in the comments. It's like a gold lace lock, lace holder. I don't know what it is, but it looks nice here on the very bottom of the laces. You got black rope laces running up. And then you have gold lace tips. And this is just like a wrapping of gold. It's not, you know, metal or plastic or anything. Still a nice touch. You got the LeBron logo. Tip of the tongue, the signature. You flip it over. Beaverton, Oregon, 330-503. Inside of the shoe features a nice, smooth, smooth leather, just like the LeBron 10 corks. And what stood out to me is this insole. It has like a red bandana paisley patterning. And as you can see, there's a dime in there with the LeBron logo, which I thought was a nice touch. I'm not sure what the inspiration is behind this because the 10 did not have any of this at all. It had a pretty much just a brown leather insole back of the shoe you got the lebron logo you got the signature and then king's cork going down this way you flip the tab down and it says king's cork and then the signature this way overall very well executed shoe and probably i'm gonna say probably the best lebron 12 so far to me in hand as i'm reviewing it bottom features a almost like a gum translucent bottom which actually complements the upper really well really nice all throughout just quality of the shoe is amazing and looks really good on feet let me know what you guys think in the comments down below um, it's unfortunate or fortunate depending on how you look at it that LeBron did not win the championship had he won I think these probably would did better in the market even the whole LeBron 12 model probably would have did better had he won the previous year and this year. And I'm going to throw these on feet so you guys can check them out. Um, thanks for watching. Peace.